Let's practice using the Nernst equation. As you can remember, the Nernst equation solves for the individual equilibrium potential of the ion that you're calculating for. In this case, we're going to be solving for potassium. This line re right here represents the membrane that's permeable only to, cast to potassium. So, so chlorine will not be crossing the membrane. Now to solve for the Nernst equation, the Nernst equation sets the equilibrium potential of the ion you're solving for, in this case potassium, equal to the 62 log of the ECF, or the extracellular fluid concentration, so 10 millimolar molar of KCl, over the concentration of the intracellular fluid, in this case 100, 100 millimolar. molar. And you should get an answer after you plug and chug of negative 62 millivolts. This is the equilibrium potential of potassium.